This video is going to be actually into the discussion of Bastard Heavy Metal Fantasy, episode 6. The is now going to commence. Oh, alright. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Ah, really? I have a feeling he has not. Okay, we'll see. So, now we're dealing with the girl. Is she also a virgin? She probably is. Maybe actually she doesn't have to be, but we'll see. Peace negotiations. Oh. Fighting? Yeah, she's gonna get, yep, she's definitely joining the site. Mm-hmm, yeah, well, explanation? Oh, he did. Of course, elf. Where do the elves come from? The outfit. Hmm, I mean, is she an elf? Hmm, hmm. Okay, backstory. Wow. Is that him or is she dreaming about that? I mean, she's definitely dreaming, but is it him? Yes. Oh, yep. Oh, he kept the secret? How? Yes, I agree with that statement. But I agree with the statement. Okay, so she's just a jealous ex. Okay, I think she's destroying her own army. She's a woman, eh? Hmm, why do I find that suspicious? Hmm. <laughs> Indeed. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Another woman, of course. A spider. <laughs> oh, okay. Now there's nothing. But yeah, he's right, it's pretty fishy, eh? Yeah. Is he moving to the left or is it me? The dragon, I mean. Hmm. Oh, totally a dragon. Yeah, I'm certain he would love that. That's a castle! Hmm. Yep. Goodbye. Clear if this was a trap, right? Yep. In space. She just said his name again and the subtitles didn't... What? What did he just say? Did he read that, right? Yeah. Okay, now now I would feel suspicious. Like, so, okay, okay, well, it is, it totally is. Wars. Okay, I like Wars. <laughs> I'm sorry, that line always cracks me up. Oh my goodness, Wars, are you serious? Yep, trap. Hmm. Well, he's a pretty buff, I feel like he can. Hmm. Yeah, of course you are. Oh. Yep, I know people that would hate watching this. I mean, I hate it. God. I mean, he's not okay, it probably hurts him, but... Uh, the girls really do look alike, don't they? <laughs> Illusion. And yep. Oh. He controls it now? Oh. When did he? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Indeed, but uh, come on, you're a woman. It's forgiven. Wow. Of course. And you're a... Is she gonna kiss him and he's going to turn into Lucian? Oh my goodness. Now, at the end, he's gonna get it anyway. But I hope he's thinking about the fact that if you kiss, you... God, they're actually doing that. Okay, this is a shonen manga. I, I agree with that, I suppose. Wow. She's already 100% one over. Well, I do appreciate that they didn't show the entire thing. Wait. Wait, did he fall asleep? Wait, now that I'm mentioning that, did he not do it then? I'm confused. Why didn't you do it? Interesting, so he chose not to do it. I actually am more interested in the fact that he didn't do it. I feel like she's gonna say it's okay. Oh. Wow, it actually okay, that went well. He's a curse to everyone. Well, uh... I mean, I actually have much less to say about this episode. Yeah, this, the discussion of this one is gonna be so quick that I'm actually set towards the next one immediately. I don't have really that much to say. Obviously, you know, he seduced that woman, but it didn't lead to anything in the end. I mean, he said he bite... He bite? I think it's just bite. Right? It's bite in every single one. Okay, anyway. Uh, he bite her... He... No, it's not. But it doesn't sound right. He did bite her. But I suppose that's literally everything he did do. He was simply unwilling. I guess they're not gonna reiterate to why he was unwilling. I guess we'll see in the future. There is only 12 episodes of this, so I'm really unsure where they're gonna go. I think I saw four girls in the outro, because I haven't watched the outro completely, but I have seen it every single time whenever, obviously, the show ends. So, there's four girls in it, and now I guess we know all of them, because our girl is gonna be the last, right? I think so. But then, uh, this went as well as it did. We did learn that apparently ancient magic is something insanely powerful, and that our girl has become strong enough. We learned some of her backstory, that uh, Dark Schneider is the one that did actually oh my goodness take care of her uh pretty much raised her i mean granted now she's pretty much 100 years old so yeah and oh, i guess elves do exist so i'm actually very confused about that clearly enough they are demi humans like goblins giants and so forth there is obviously some different types of sorcerers 
And are elves something else entirely? Are they not monsters or are they monsters that are just very human-like? I really don't know. This world is definitely intriguing though. I think that's about that when it comes to this episode. Wars was definitely a very interesting introduction. Wars is fun, I do enjoy him. I really wonder what is his point though. And obviously enough we know that Elven Girl, even though she says that she will not be seduced and she hates the fact that he had harem. I guess she really did love him, but the fact that he had a secret harem really annoyed her. And maybe now that he's different, she'll be okay with him? I don't know. My nose is trying to kill me. Allergies are trash. Well, besides the point though, this was actually a much more tame episode than I thought. I really thought that they're gonna go all the way in. I actually thought they would. And it seems like Lucian actually thought the same thing too. But everyone's calling him Dark Schneider, and I feel like they're soon gonna realize that he might in the end truly be Lucian. Just an adult version of him. In a way. I suppose. We'll see. Overall though, I'm just super excited about the future. And I'm probably gonna watch the next one and I really should end it because I watched every single one of these in a row and yeah, that's a little too much. Uh, yeah, seven episodes in a row, a little too much. Anyhow, though, hope you had fun. That's you guys, I'm and I hope you enjoyed it so much as I did.